talking, but I think a lot. I do. She knows, you know. There's too much trouble in this world to add to it. It's true. She knows, you know. If you've got a friend that sticks to you and really thinks you're swell, and though you do some silly things, she understands so well. Then you've got one like Cynthia is to me, as you can tell. She knows, you know. She went to the psychiatrist once. That's a fowler who searches your brain, you know. Well, he looked all through her head. He, he couldn't find anything. Oh, he had her stretched out on a couch. It was a beautiful couch too. It was all satin, with green stripes coming down it. And at the end of the green stripes, it had like gold. And the gold sort of laced itself in and out of the green stripes. And you know where a couch comes up at the end? Well, it had like a halo of hyacinths with pink pigeons settling on the stems. And she had her head in it. She looked beautiful on there. Well, you can tell, you can tell. The nurse of the psychiatrist came in and saw her, and she said, she said she'd never seen such a sight in all her life. And don't think she is simple, because believe me, she is not. She knows, you know. And at some things, well, I won't say which, she's really very hot. She knows, you know. She can sew and knit and cook and bake. In fact, she knows her biz. And when she's really in the mood, oh, she can't half make things fizz. But as for being in the mood, she very seldom is. <laughs> she knows, you know. Oh, she knows.